Thank you. Thousands of people drive to and from the University of South Florida every day. And starting this morning, slow down because the speed limit is changing in one stretch near the university. News Channel 8's Janet Jones is live near 56th Street checking out the road for us there this morning. So, Jana, this is a big change that drivers will need to pay attention to. It is good morning to you both. The speed limit here is going down by 10 miles an hour, and this is such a busy area with so many students coming and going that drivers are definitely going to notice a difference in traffic patterns. Now, the new signs are not up just yet, but sometime today you'll likely see new signs up that signify the speed limit changing from 50 miles an hour to 40 miles an hour. The exact area we're talking about is 56th Street between Fowler Avenue and Fletcher Avenue. During morning commutes and rush hour in the afternoon, Noon, the area can be a madhouse between university traffic as well as Moffett Cancer Center and getting into the Temple Terrace area. The new speed limit also will accompany the mid block crossings that were recently installed to improve pedestrian safety between the school and student housing. Now, while this new speed limit goes into effect today, there is going to be a two week grace period before drivers are issued any citation. So you're hearing it here first. You're warned right now, but in two weeks from now, Gail, if you don't slow down, you could get a ticket. And it's almost like you need to put yourself in a routine because when they lowered the speed limit on Bayshore Boulevard in Tampa, it took a while for people to adjust to that. All right. Thanks so much, Jana. Well, in Pinellas,